friends wants to go out and do something that week. We had a bit of a soup binge, I would say. I've noticed though with this one friend that she just moves so fast through zoos or aquariums while I love to get my shots and also observe the animals for quite a while before moving on to the next. It's not every day that you get to see kinds of animals. I actually almost went into zoology because it's one of my dream jobs to work as a rehabber or at a zoo. In the meantime though, I plan on applying to be a raptor rehabber or you know volunteer and I really 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 want my own lizards to keep. I already know what species separate note, this lizard on this post was a Texas spiny lizard, and there was a giant one in the brush. I mean, it was absolutely massive. This day, I don't actually remember what we were doing, but we did stop to check out all of these wildflowers on the side of the road. I don't particularly enjoy Texas, one thing that I can especially appreciate is the variety and sheer volume of wildflowers that bloom in late spring. Fields are filled to the brim with primroses, Indian blankets, blue bonnets, blue bonnets, blue bonnets, wine cups, and brown-eyed Susan. favorite flowers I've come across here is the Indian blanket. They are also called fire wheels. They're an amazing flower to grow in your own garden and attract a variety of native wildlife. They prefer sandy soils but can tolerate most conditions so long as it's not flooded. This upcoming flower is so small and they usually don't grow in such big bunches. It is called blue-eyed grass. I would not mind a giant garden bed filled with this stuff or maybe surround a garden's perimeter with it. This other flower is called flea bane which isn't the most.
real dinosaurs, like real dinosaur footprints, and you, in some of them, you could even see like the paw pad imprints. That was incredible. In fact, I think I'll put in some photos that aren't mine, just so you guys can see what, what I'm talking about, how detailed these footprints are. I just realized how many times I said footprint. <laughs> After a lot of hiking and swimming, we decided to just sit down and enjoy the fish spa. On the way out of the park, we saw this cat and we thought that it was like a bobcat or a Jack Rondi until we rolled up next to it <laughs> and it was like, why are you, what are you staring at? But with that, this video.